Hey friends, Jackie here from Interact with part two of creating a quiz using chat GPT. So in the previous video, I showed you how to come up with the best quiz topic in just a matter of seconds. And now I'm going to show you how to actually build out that quiz. So uh, this is the prompt right here that you're going to want to add into chat GPT. And we're just going to want to update a few things. First, you're going to want to include the outcomes or the results that you want somebody to get from your quiz. Now, you know, you your audience best, you know your business best. So if you can just come up with the outcomes, right? Different segments of people in your audience, um, different answers, personas to this question that we're asking that relates to your quiz. Go ahead and just write those in there. If you do need help coming up with the outcomes, there's a prompt for that. Here it is. Simply tell ChatGPT who you are, who you sell to, and your quiz title. For example, if you're a business coach like Sarah, say something like, speak as a certified business coach for female coaches. Literally, it can do it all for you. Okay, so once I paste in the potential outcomes of this quiz, I'm going to scroll down just a little bit further. And right here, I'm going to add in my actual quiz title that I want to write. Now, you can leave this as the prompt and just sort of generic follow this uh, sort of formula. But if you can get more specific, or rather, the more specific you can get, the better output or quiz we're going to get from ChatGPT. So I already know which quiz title I'm using. I'm going to pop that in there, and then I will leave the rest the same. Now, a little pro tip for you to write engaging questions here or to have AI write us engaging questions, you want to phrase your quiz title uh, with a you or a your. So how can your business achieve consistent 10K month rather than how can what's the best way for a business to achieve 10K months, right? So uh, just something to note there, try to have a you or a your speaking to the people that are taking your quiz in the title. So once you've updated this with your outcomes and your quiz title, go ahead and submit it. And this prompt will actually write out the entire quiz for us. Let's see what it comes up with. And here's the quiz. It was as easy as that. So it looks like ChatGPT is recommending that we change the title. Feel free to take that suggestion or use the title that you were originally planning on using. Don't forget with an Interact quiz, once you publish it, you're always able to make changes simply by changing it in your builder and then republishing the quiz, which I'll show you in our next video uh, when we actually go to build this quiz in Interact. But before I show you that, I just want to walk through this quickly. Uh, we're getting from ChatGPT a recommended cover photo to use. There's a description here, which gets really specific to my, as a business coach, uh, audience's goals here, which is achieving these consistent 10K months. So the description of this quiz is discover your business strategy personality to find out how to achieve consistent 10K months. Anybody wanting to achieve 10K months here will probably want to take this quiz so that they can figure out the right strategy for them. And again, that is my ideal customer. That is who I was trying to target by taking this quiz. So I think this is going to be a good one. Here's some of the questions that ChatGPT came up with. What's your approach to marketing? And you can see it's giving us three answers. And at the end of each answer, it's telling us which outcome this answer relates back to. This will come in handy when we're in Interact and we go to connect the logic to the quiz, meaning when someone answers specific questions, they will get the result that makes the most sense for them. In addition to just getting titles and answers and questions, you're also getting copy for the opt-in form. So this is where you're encouraging your lead to subscribe once they finish taking your quiz. That's where you collect their email to grow your list. And then we're also getting copy for each of the outcome titles. So the result titles and a brief description for each one. Go ahead and check out the next video where I'm going to be putting this quiz into Interact.